Hello and welcome to the latest episode of Talking About Marvel Strike Force. I am your host, Chad Thomas. So for this episode, I have gained three new characters. The first being Blob. Not terribly excited about him, um, but I haven't really played around with the Brotherhood uh, with him since I've acquired him, so I'll check it out. I mean, Magneto's pretty strong, so we'll see how that goes. The second being Squirrel Girl. I surprisingly got her fairly easy uh, just by playing um, the campaign for her and um, I didn't even have to go to the medium level, uh, whatever I got with the shards uh, in the orbs, I acquired her so that was, that was pretty cool. And the last being a character I've long waited for and it finally happened and that is Agent Coulson. Alright, so let's take a look at the last episode's top 10. Alright, so there's not a whole lot of changes in this episode. Uh, Sabretooth got knocked out of the top 10 and Mr. Sinister slimed his way in. We've got uh, four characters who actually advanced since the last episode, and the greatest advancement goes to Magneto, so he is the most valuable player for this episode. Way to go, Eric. So, I guess from what I'm understanding, the next legendary character to be released is going to be Dr. Octopus. Um, not sure how I feel about that, if I'm really all that interested, um, I mean, I'll give it a shot for sure. I'm still working hard on trying to get Beast and Emma Frost, those are the two new characters that I really want more than anything. So I'm gonna continue to chug away at that, uh, however I can. Um, I've spent quite a few power cores on orbs, um, so we'll see how that goes. Thank you so much for watching this episode of Talking About Marvel Strike Force. Certainly appreciate the views, the likes, the subscribes, even the dislikes. Feel free to share our videos with anyone who's a fan of Marvel Strike Force. We appreciate that as well. And as always, love and light to you all.